today I am taking you to Alpine Village in Torrens, which is basically Long Beach. It is the biggest European grocery store in California, and it also has a restaurant next to it. That's the market, and that's the restaurant. For the restaurant, you have to look up the hours because they're kind of weird, but it has amazing German food, and this grocery store is the bomb if you're from Europe. It's going to be like heaven on earth um, every time we come here. Uh, it, uh, our bill is at least a hundred dollars because once you come here you really have to buy everything because a lot of these things kind of come and go unless it's like the sausages or like the basic candies and chocolates but anything like uh, the seasonal special it will go very quickly so they already have the christmas stuff out there is so much milk a calendar Ooh, i i i need that but i'm traveling so i can't take it unfortunately right now to but i did pick up some stuff and this is christmas candy which we in europe hang up on the tree as decoration and then like eat it whatever glutwein the german hot wine more candy so here you're gonna find sweets chips sauces condiments beers, wine from all over Europe. There's candy from Italy, Germany, France, Poland, Austria, Spain. Ooh, land with pear liquor. And this is the Hungarian wine section. It has to be the biggest Hungarian wine section in America. And Tokai is a sweet wine, dessert wine, and it's very rare find. And I was mostly raised in Hungary, so I spent a, a big part of my childhood there. So this is such a treat. There's sausages from Hungary, Germany, and even Sweden and and Poland and some other places. So there's a lot to find. It's not cheap. It's a little bit overpriced. Excuse me, lady. Um, things here are a little bit overpriced. There's another grocery store called John's international market where you can find some of these things about three four dollars less so this is a hungarian sausage twelve dollars at john's it will be nine this is kind of overpriced for such a small thing so <laughs> but a few things really not a lot for 128 dollars like i said this store is kind of overpriced but it, you're gonna find stuff that you're not gonna find anywhere first i got a wafer cake um i don't see this very often and i make a ukrainian cake with it and then i got two tokais i love this wine not a lot of people like sweet wine and this is like super super sweet but it's such a treat because it tastes so good and then i stocked up on candy uh, this does not melt <laughs> trust me this is the uh, orange flavored orange jelly on the inside these ones are assorted very delicious i mean yeah i mean i started eating it right away and then i got a few of these these were not good <laughs> so um if you see this brand tb just skip it it's it's really not good not good chocolate at all <laughs> but i also found some other goodies this french candy this was actually i mean chocolate this was actually 14 dollars. it is a pear liquor it was not great this on the other hand i'm obsessed with it it's german it's filled with apricot jam and this is my favorite it's layered with marzipan and apple jam which you can also find an aldi also got puppy seeds very rare find and super 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 cheap so i got two bags of those and they have the best bread crumbs because our european bread crumbs are different than american got some potatoes that we can eat quickly on just some bread and they're so delicious and i think these were actually a pretty good price so i'm very happy with my find and come check this store out if you live in california